This is J9LP, and I will be taking you through this addendum video for my playthrough of Astro Boy Omega Factor. Um, this was actually going to be included in the um, uh, the last video um, of the finale of the game, but um, because since we've um, uh, got like 15, well, got over 15 minutes for the uploading, I thought I'd take advantage of that. But then, in the end, that video turned out to be something like 23 and a half minutes. And I'm thinking, well, that's sort of a bit much, really, even by kind of Let's Play standards or whatever. So, um, uh, without further ado, let's begin! Or end, whichever way you want to look at it. Um, uh, so, with this video, what I will be doing is I'm uh, showing you extra bits. Um, uh, for starters, um, uh, you can view your high score here, and you can do it in a number of different ways. From the beginning, which is essentially from the very beginning of the game, and the complete total tally of your score, um, see if my easy normal um, uh, score there and um, uh, the time, well, if you played it from beginning to end without dying, then you'll probably get a proper recording time like that. Of course I didn't, so yeah. Um, you can do it by stage, um, uh, which is essentially by the entire stage, um, uh, not necessarily being an animal. You can do the same stage by birth or rebirth. Um, uh, rebirth being the, the second um, uh, time you go through. And you can also do it by book, which is essentially each um, uh, part of the stage. So, for instance, in Metro City and, and at X Point Pacific Ocean, which is beautiful island, of course, and all the way to even to um, uh, the eighth stage of the world's greatest adventure. I see you all there. Anyways, you also have the sound test where you can play a um, map. Uh, Music for each stage and each event and each boss battle and so on and such. Pretty damn cool. Um, you can even watch events. Um, uh, the first few events just basically being the intro to the stage and all the way up to stage eight, and then you've got the um, uh, cutscenes. Which you can just go through and press start to skip. Um, you can also change your language up there, or put in your data, and you also have this! The Ultimate Character List, which is essentially a pretty much a little um, uh, kind of encyclopedia of all the characters that star in this game, including Astro! Um, which has got quite a couple of interesting facts, um, uh, like all this one, for instance, he said that Astro's hair was modelled after Tezuka's hair when in the morning, so basically Astro's hair is Tezuka's nap hair. Yeah, yeah, very mm -hmm. interesting. Also got them, uh, their, um, uh, sort of the character portraits on the side, and uh, including this one, which is... Yeah, it definitely looks like he just got up in the morning and go, I am, I am substance. Um, whatever. <laughs> so, we've got the ultimate literature test, and uh, you can also go back into the game anytime you want. And uh, as you can see, it's, this one is blue, which means you pretty much completed it. And you can still um, uh, go and play through each um, uh, stage as you want, but um, uh, there is one reason why I'll do this, as you can see you can even go through all of the, um, uh, the blocks in stage 8, but like I was saying, there is one reason why I'm being here, because 
I'm missing my couch in the Omega Factor. I'm sure you guessed who it is. Um, I'll give you a clue. At this point, somewhere, I think it was here, I met a little unicorn called Unico who gave me a wish and asked me to go back to um, uh, my old house. Astro's and um, now uh, Astro's former self's old house. Or rather, Dr. Penny's house. And you'll find something there. Let's see what you'll find. By the way, I'm not doing the voice acting on that, I promise. You won't be out here anymore, my dad voices. We'll just brief this together. Dr. Tenma isn't such a bad A after all. He's, he still loves his son and he loves his creation and he just wants him to be, grow and be a better robot person type thing. Anyways, we have Dr. Tenma in our Omega Factor, which means we have finished the Omega Factor. And just to kind of prove it, um, uh, one thing um, uh, that I don't actually, I've never actually showed you is you can go into the Omega Factor any time you want by pressing select in a stage. And you know, just to prove it, that is pretty much everyone in the Omega Factor, including Astro. And you can view any of them. Also, if you press the um, uh, left shoulder button, you also get your stats, which are obviously full. Anyways, so that's it. That is pretty much everything now. <laughs> great, way, great way to leave the game and get clobbered by a robot. Fantastic. Anyway, folks, that is it. That is Astro Boy Omega Factor with the GBA and I'm uh, I'd like to take in the opportunity to um, uh, say thanks to whoever was watching this all day from the beginning and sorry for the year I got given you the advance it's too late now isn't it anyways well, as I said before thanks for watching and keep on playing folks